Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I done brought my girl back so I could do a cute another ponytail on her. So let's get straight into it. So right here, we're thinking about doing a side part with a cute little bun. So I'm sectioning off the hair that I'm gonna leave out and then I'm gonna start working on the ponytail. So as y'all can see, I'm brushing the hair into place. We're gonna do a high bun. So brushing everything together and making sure everything is intact. Once I do that, I'm going in with my favorite ponytail spray, which is even the black can. And y'all, like y'all know, it works wonders. I'm going to start at the end and start working towards the top, blow drying the end. And y'all basically going to see me do the whole process of me doing that all around her head. So as y'all can see, the back is molded down pretty well. So now I'm about to start working on the front. But before I start spraying down, I'm separating her baby hairs that I don't want to be molded down. I'm just separating that and then continuing the same process. Okay, so now that I pushed up some of the hair, I'm gonna take the rubber band off to tighten it, tighten the ponytail better. Go back in with my even spray and continue the same process. Okay, so now that I like how tight and firm the ponytail is, I'm gonna go in with my Sparkler Sheen Blush. And that's basically gonna help the ponytail give it that shine that it needs. So now that I'm done with that, I went ahead and braided the rest of the hair down and now I'm adding on my neck strip to wrap it around and then rubber band it to make sure it's secure. Now it's time to glue the bundles on. So she wanted to add a little hint of pink in it. So I'm adding a little bit of a pink track, putting the glue on, you know, going in a circular motion with the glue, drying it on and just wrap 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 so pink first then i add a little black layer after the black layer i added a little bit more pink and finished it off with the black y'all i'm sitting here editing this video and cracking up like i had brought my friend a plate from work and she is too happy honey busting down i know that right look <laughs> Yes, friend, eat. And y'all ain't gonna cap that food. It was good, it was good. Don't get no higher than this. No, 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 no. Right. Boy, you know I grind when I pull up this change of mind. Your mind, when I step on the scene, man. Can't wait to back it up. Your head's still a dope, but it ain't back enough. I'm supplying my man, I'm in demand. Soon as I land, just know I roll with them goons. Okay, now the ponytail is all done, and now I'm about to separate some of the strand of hair because she wants some of it to dangle out of the bun. So that's what I'm doing, taking a few out, and then I'm going to begin wrapping it. Now, y'all, I'm not going to lie. We was kind of trying to figure out what type of bun she wanted. We didn't know if she wanted loose or tight, so we just ended up coming up with a tight look. So right here, I'm just adding in a few bobby pins to make sure that the ponytail, well, the bun is firm and then she didn't like how long some of the strands of hair were hanging so i wrapped those around and added bobby pins to make it stay in the bun Okay, so now we're working on the bangs. So of course, I'm going to be using some of the track hair to add on the front because we wanted to give more of a longer look. So I'm adding track hair, the pink of course, and I'm going to add in some of the black and just make it blend really well. Don't get no higher than this. No, 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 no. 
now the tracks are all added in and we're going to start focusing on making sure that her natural hair that's leaving out at the top isn't having any flyaways so i'm going in with that even spray this helps really well and just putting it at the base of the hair at the top because it makes a world of difference so making sure that's secure then i'm going to add like a little swoop in the front to make it look crisp y'all like just watch me work just watch me work all right so now that we're liking how the top looks i'm gonna trim it a little bit and start swooping it now she didn't want that harsh glue to your forehead swoop so i just spray a little bit more even did my blow dryer and just try to make it look as natural and soft looking as possible so i'm flipping it around her ear i added bobby pins to make sure that it's secure and it doesn't go anywhere and yeah that's the swoop also to y'all i tried to curl the end of it but it didn't work we had to end up curling it with my finger and put it in a pin curl in it but it ended up working out so if you ever try put curls in synthetic hair organique yeah it's not gonna work so all that is done now i'm working on the baby hairs adding a little bit more of that spray on the bank and y'all we are practically done like the look came together super cute it was super easy she liked it i loved it and get at y'all girl if y'all want that hair done i really appreciate you guys for watching giving me the support if you're based in Atlanta, please get your hair done with me. And yeah, thanks you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.